Welcome everyone. Thank you for joining me today. This is Technology Made Basic and today's video is going to be about dark mode. So dark mode in respect to Windows 11. I do have a Windows 10 version of the same video. So make sure to check that out if you are on Windows 10. Uh, it's a little bit different to set uh, dark mode on Windows 10. I do want to make mention though before we get started that dark mode is commonly referred to as by different names. Uh, the more common names that I've seen are dark mode, dark theme, black mode, night mode, light on dark mode, and I believe lights out mode are like the most common names I've seen. But for the purpose of this video, we'll refer to it as dark mode. So dark mode is, is a it's a color scheme that typically uh, reduces the light emitted by, for example, a desktop monitor, a laptop screen, or a mobile device such as an iPhone or an Android phone by swapping to a dark background and light text, making the readability better and less strenuous for your eyes. So there's a couple benefits to it. I do have this article that I'm going to also link in the description. So if you want to check it out, that talks about a little bit uh, when to use dark mode in Windows 11. So let's just read this top paragraph here. Let's just highlight it here. Uh, dark mode is a popular setting in many social apps and browsers, and it's also available as a feature in most pop in most operating systems. Uh, many people turn dark mode on because they prefer how it looks, but there are other benefits. Learn how to make dark mode uh, work in Windows 11 and why you might want to use it. So what are uh, some of the benefits of dark mode? The aesthetic preference. So you may prefer that dark look with the light uh, text. Uh, it's easier on the eye, so less strain, eye strain. Uh, better for darker locations. So if you're in a low lit environment and preserves battery if you're on a mobile device like a laptop or a phone. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and minimize this. Again, I'll link this in, in the description. So there's two ways to get to the option to set uh, Windows 11 to dark mode uh, or dark theme. So... The easiest way is if you do a right click anywhere on the desktop where you don't have like an icon, so just do a right click, it'll bring up this context menu. Uh, in the context menu, what we want to choose is personalize. So let's go ahead and do a left click on that. And once this uh, window opens up, what we want to choose from the personalization, uh, which is already uh, highlighted, is colors over here on the right hand side. And it's going to take us to the uh, screen where we can go ahead and set dark mode. Now, the other way to get here, there is another context menu. If you right, if you do a right click over the start icon or over the start button in the center of the screen, typically on Windows 11, it'll bring up the context menu. And from here, we can click settings. So do a left click on settings and it'll bring up the uh, system uh, window. And from here, we want to uh, make sure to click on personalization. Now, the other way we went, we didn't have to click on it because it, it took us right here. So this, you do have a couple more clicks, but there's always multiple ways to get to the same thing in uh, Windows. So again, choose colors on the right-hand side. And in order to choose uh, dark mode, uh, we'll go ahead where it says choose your mode. Right now, I believe it defaults the light on Windows, whether it's Windows 10 or 11. So just do a left click and let's choose dark. And that's it. So as you can see now, the start menu the uh, taskbar, the bar that spans, uh, that typically, typically is on the bottom of the screen, that spans for, uh, the width of the screen, is also dark now, and so are the windows. Uh, it all switches over to dark mode. So there are two different, two other options that I want to make uh, mention of. One is transparency effects. Some of these windows and, and the taskbar and stuff have sort of this transparent, translucent effect. But what we can do is we can shut this off to make things a little bit darker. So if we turn that off, as you can see, now you can't really see through the, the windows or the taskbar or the start menu. So it took away that transparency effect. So keep that in mind if you want to make things a little bit darker, make sure to turn that transparency effect off. You can also choose your accent color. So as right now, I believe it defaults to this like light, uh, like light gray color. Uh, the best way to show this is on this left-hand side by the personalization. So if I switch this over to manual instead of automatic, so automatic windows choose the color for you. But if you choose manual, you can select a color. So let's choose red just to have it stand out. And as you can see now, it switched over to red. So you can also do some uh, touches to it. So to change the accent color, that's pretty much it. So that's how to change uh, Windows 11 to dark mode. And again, just keep in mind that you have this accent color option as well in transparency effects. Um, but that's all we have for you today. So thank you so much for watching. Take care until next time.